Hello and welcome back. This is Greg French. Uh, today we're going to look at FTP, uh, FileZilla. This is an open source program that we use for uploading and downloading files to a website. Uh, this is going to be a demo. FTP stands for File Transfer Protocol and it is a utility that we use. Uh, it uses TCP services uh, at the application layer of the OSI. I want to draw your attention to ComputerRepairTrainingPlus.com. This is a website that I've set up for my students. It has additional resources, uh, including uh, FTP articles. So you might find some more information there that might be useful. Uh, first thing we're going to look at here is uh, FileZilla. And again, FTP, this is going to be a demo uh, showing you how to upload and download files to your website. For this part of the demo, we're going to go ahead and type in FileZilla in our Google search bar. And uh, we're going to go ahead and go to the FileZilla uh, website. And we're going to come down here to this uh, file called Win32 Setup. This is a compressed, uh, zip compressed file of the, Win, of the FileZilla. Go ahead and click on that and download it. And I'm going to go ahead and save this into a folder that I've created uh, in a download folder. I usually keep my files outside of my Windows operating system because I do replace my Windows operating system from time to time. So I'm going to go ahead and save this in this folder. Uh, it is saved. Very quick to download. Small file. It's only about uh, 4 megs. And I'm going to go ahead and run it. Uh, I'm going to make sure that it uh, uncompresses inside of... Uh, my folder for FileZilla and I'll go ahead and uh, do that. Now FileZilla, uh, first thing you need to do is come up here to the top of the screen. You're going to have host, username, and password. You need to go ahead and type in here the name of your website. Uh, then you want to type in the username that your website host provider has provided you so that you can log into what's called cPanel. cPanel is the configuration panel that the website host provider has provided you uh, for configuring your website. And they will provide you a username that you need to type in here and a password that you need to type in here. So I'm going to go ahead and type in my uh, website out of my uh, screen here. I have what's called the local site. This is my computer. And I need to go to my files. And I again have a file directory set up uh, for my WordPress files that I'm going to be uh, uploading to my site here. So, backup directory, uh, whoops, WordPress. And inside this WordPress directory, I have plugins and themes. Now the theme that I want to upload to my website is called Blue Spot. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. I'm going to come over here to my remote site and open up my root folder. And inside my root folder, I'm going to look for the public HTML folder. Open up. And in the root, you see there's three folders, uh, WordPress or WP Admin, Content, and Includes. I'm going to go ahead and open up the uh, WP Content. Inside here, you can see I have two more folders, Plugins and Themes. So I'm going to go highlight that Themes folder. And this is where I'm going to put in uh, my new theme called Blue Spot. So come back, in, back over here to my local site. Uh, select my Blue Spot. Right-click, and I'm going to go to Upload. Now, you notice up here, it's, it's quickly uploading uh, the Blue Spot folder. And it's finished. Come back over here to my remote site. And you can see I have a new folder called Blue Spot. Open that up, and you can see inside I have all the new uh, files and folders. Uh, pretty, pretty easy, uh, pretty simple. If I want to delete and remove Blue Spot, I can just right click on it and go to Delete, select Yes and it will quickly remove Blue Spot again from my website. So FileZilla, very powerful, very easy to use, uh, very fast uh, file transfer protocol for taking files and uploading them to your website or downloading them or deleting them. A uh, very good uh, tool for managing your website. 
want to thank you very much for your time. Uh, again, I want to just draw your attention to uh, ComputerRepairTrainingPlus.com. This is a website uh, that I've set up for my students. Uh, it has some additional resources uh, available there uh, concerning FTP and some other uh, other resources you might find useful or helpful. Thanks again for your time. Bye.